This week, the Monster Challenge headed to Tilton Road, where the Royal George played host to a darts contest. Keris Harrop was at the hockey for the girls, whilst Tom Adiemi was hoping to claw back a win for the boys. After a quick warm-up, things were ready to get underway, but not before some mind games. Well, Keris, while Tom was uh, playing a lung busty 90 minutes last night, what were you doing? Practicing the full burn, I've got to prepare myself for the challenge. I don't want to let the girls down, so cheeky 20 minutes of practice is uh, all I need to win the competition. When I was at Oldham, we had a, there was a dart board at the training ground, and um, we had a, we had a tournament, and I made the semi-finals, but then um, because of a poor run of results, we were then banned from playing darts, so uh, I never got to play my semi-final. Um, so yeah, potentially I could have been the best player, darts player at that club, but it just um, never found out for sure. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty confident. I mean, I've seen Tom practicing. Doesn't look up to scratch, to be honest. So uh, confident I could bring it over the girls again. This is like my my semi-final now, so uh, I'm really looking forward to it, and I'll, I'll give it 100% like I always do. It was closest to the ball to decide who goes first. Oh, I can't get closer than that. Come on, I can't get much closer than that. Is it worth me throwing? <laughs> The players had to score down from 501, finishing on a double. After a fair few rounds, Keris needed double two to claim victory, and Tom needed double four. Well Tom, Monster Challenge victory and much like that performance against Burnley, the men are refusing to go down without a fight, aren't they? Yeah, that's it, you know, we've got great spirit and in the end that was just too much for, for uh, Kerish there. <laughs> Kerish, was that a tough one to take? Yeah, I'm pretty disappointed, I mean, I was winning up until the last few throws but double two was just killing me. Yeah, and Tom, going into the next challenge, obviously this, on this weekly Monster Challenge, uh, what's your tips for the comp competitors taking part? To be honest, now that I've won mine, I don't really care. It's, uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, I think, you, yeah, you just got to uh, believe in yourself and, and, and hopefully we'll get the results. Okay, it's just finally, do you think you're in for a bit of stick now? Definitely, the girls are going to abuse me. I mean, you know, I'll sort of do it the big ear at training, saying, you know, I've got the technique, I've got, got the, the, the flick and all that, but no, they're definitely going to give me some stick for that. That victory puts the boys just one behind the girls, so it's all to play for in the next Monster Challenge.